Yeah, it's how it's done. Um, <laughs> I was thinking to work. Anyway, um, so this morning I did not want to get up. Like, I don't know if it was watching The Bachelor last night, like staying up late, watching The Bachelor, blowing my eyes out. I don't know what it was. But I was tired this morning. I'm lining up at 5:30, and I did not want to. I did not want to get out of bed and do my work. And that's like doing my workouts in the morning is my thing. Like it, I don't, I haven't posted in a while. I haven't posted my video, but I have been getting up every single morning and getting in my family and social workouts. And then um, either running in the evening or running back to my workout, depending on what my timeline looks like for the day. And the fact that I didn't want to get up this morning was like kind of disappointing to me. And it made me move. Like, it only took away more and more motivation as the day went on, and I'm tired. Um, and my mom is training for a marathon. We're both running a half marathon at the same time. So we're both, like, on the same plan, technically. Um, Whereas is just going to continue to pass the half marathon, and I honestly think I'm just going to continue with her as well, because I really like doing this double workout thing. Um, and now the it's nice. It's really nice to go outside and run. Um, but anyway, that's the short. Driving out and we went for our three mile run today um, together because it was so nice outside and I was also working at some school that she was at. I was like, great, 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 and I was teaching. Um, and so we went out for a run after school um, and got our run in. Well, then I got home and I ate dinner and I was dilly dally. Well, then I remembered I have my challenges. Every single day, I, I, talk to people about just need to do it. If you set your mind to something and you have goals, then keep striving towards reaching those goals, making small changes. And what small changes um, are going to add up um, to help you reach that final goal. But first you need to have that step in mind and you need to be taking action. And action is one thing that I stress a lot. Like, just do it. I don't care if you're doing it full blown, like your final goal is. But, like, you, I'm not, I actually don't even expect you to do it. I don't expect you to do it. I don't expect you to follow your workout and nutrition. I don't expect that because I don't do it either. And, like, that's why I'm posting this video because it's so, so true. Like, I did not want to do it. But I stress the nutrition all the time. Um, so I was like, you know what, you need to do this, you need to check in with your challenges, you need to show them that you have shit days too, you don't want to do it, I'm mom, I'm 40 year old mother, I'm just going to tell you the same one, so my 40 year old mother dragged me for a run, and almost kicked my butt, because I was like, well actually, I was just like, I didn't want to do it, and then you set your mind on something, you set so negative about it, it's so hard to do it. Get out. Like you're gonna have the face you're gonna come back. So I started off like that, but then I once I got out of bed, things up is a lot better. But she, I don't know, she's been training, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I used to be so much faster. But anyway, um, she dragged me out there, she walked me down, but then I remembered all of my challenges to get me going the same way.
Obviously, I'm like high on my high on endorphins and <laughs> whatnot, but have a great night, everyone. And no matter how hard the struggle is or how, how low your motivation is, you can always pick it up and count on me to pull you up too. Okay? Bye, guys.